Yes, so glad to see the sun this morning. Blue skies. Awesome. That gloomy, rainy weather was getting to me. Needed this today. Sweet. Be a good day to get out and do some exploring. Beautiful. I'm just having a great morning here so far. It's just so nice to have the sun shining on me, listening to the birds singing. But I'm going to go ahead and break camp for a little bit today, go out and do some exploring. Uh, I'm going to check out the National Park area here, and I uh, heard there's a nice waterfall to check out, so we'll start there. Okay, let's go see what we can find. Wow, what a nice day today. I am feeling it. Nice country through here in Ohio. Very nice. Brandy Wine Falls, bike and hike trail. Two falls. All right, we're gonna take a little walk down to the falls. Check this out, I can hear them from here. A little information on the park here. I guess it was created in 1974. Brandy Wine Falls. Early 1800s, they used it to uh, run a mill. Interesting. You can pause that and read it if you'd like. Well, this is neat. This boardwalk goes right against these cliffs here. A little bit of water dripping down here. Let's hear the falls up ahead. That was cool. Glad we checked out the waterfall. I'm gonna head whoa. I'm gonna head over to an area called Brexville. That's what it's called. Reservation, Brexville Reservation. There's supposed to be some nice trails and all that. Got rain in the forecast for tomorrow, so I'm gonna try to get out and explore today while I can. I saw a sign for Deer Lick Cave. Not Deer Lick Cave, Deer Lick. Let's see if we can find it. Let's go check it out. Looks like they got coyotes in the area. Nice. All right, let's go check out this cave, see if we can find it. This would be Deer Lick Cave, I guess. Not very deep, but kind of cool. See water dripping through here. Ooh, super muddy in there. That's it. can see some mineral deposits way back in there. Pretty cool. That was just a super short walk down here. I thought it was going to be like a deeper cave. Still worth checking out. Nice out here. Just a beautiful day to be out exploring.
Station Road Bridge Trailhead. That was fun checking out the bridges there. Got a lot of really good shots. If I'm not taking a video, I'm usually taking still photos. Got quite a few of them uh, on my Instagram account, Adventure Van Man on Instagram. Well, I got a tip from a local. I need to go check out Swenson's Drive-In. It's a drive-up burger place. It's uh, pretty near where I'm camped, so I'm gonna go check that out. I'm quite hungry. I was gonna make up some lunch in the van, but I gotta check out some of the local eats here. But kind of unique, you pull up and the kid comes running out and takes your order and then brings you your food. So we'll go see how it is. You guys see our spot here, Swenson's. I wanna be by the menu here, let's do that get up out of the sun a little bit too. I feel like the report of the week doing a food review in the uh, vehicle here. But anyway, the burger is good. It's got two different sauces on it. The bottom is like a relish barbecue sauce and then the top is kind of like a tartar sauce. Really good meat patties. Dang, really good. And try these fried mushrooms. Very nice. Now we gotta give this cherry ginger ale a sip. Dang, that's different, but good. Yeah, I gotta give Swenson's the thumbs up. All right, well that was a unique experience. Those kids literally run out to your vehicle as soon as you pull up. Interesting, the menu here does not have prices on it though. But this food was good, enjoyed it. I'm a fan of the American style burger. The sauces were an interesting twist. Oops, <laughs> see, they're running. our Silver Springs campground, city of Stowe, Ohio. And the sign says $12 for out-of-state uh, campers, but I got charged 15. There's no drop box or anything. It's just uh, a park attendant comes by a few times a day, and if they see a new person here, they come and register you, take your info, and collect the fee. That's kind of different. Never experienced that. They do, like I said, off to the right here, have the RV dump, big trash dumpster. Uh, no actual bathrooms. There are two sets of porta potties on each side of the campground. I think if you count them up, there's a total of like 25 spots. Looks like another travel trailer pulled in since I left. Oh, I got my nice little spot in the trees here. Perfect. Ah, so glad I got a nice sunny day today. It would have been kind of lame to just been cooped up in the van for the two days I was here. So I think tomorrow I'm going to get up and we'll be heading into Pennsylvania. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you're all doing well out there and we'll see you very soon in the next video. Take care. Peace.